Welcome back to Team Smudge Racing Game, and as you can see, we are in a, um, we are going to be doing the Storm Chasers Vehicle Special Edition today, and we are going to be doing, uh, we're in the Victoria, uh, the Ford Victoria Crown, uh, I do apologise, and we've got it in the Tornado Pursuit Vehicle, hence why the uh, light's on the top there, and today we're going to... Let me just turn that off. Oh, I completely missed it again. There we go. So we got the uh, Tornado Pursuit Vehicle. Um, let's have a look at the inside. Quite nice. If you're out driving and seeing old tumble down barn, mate, better stop and have a look. And we've got quite a few other cars to... I do apologise. <laughs> but we've got quite a few cars to go through today. So we've got the Tornado 2015... Uh, 2017, sorry. Um, Raptor. Yeah, the Tornado Hunters one. Uh, let's have a look. So we quickly fast travel to over here. There's the Nissan Titan, which I'm going to show you guys in a second. Because um, we have got that in a vehicle. Um, so as you can see, we have got it in the... Uh, Tornado Hunters um, the Orange Edition one um, with the oh, da, 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 da. so yep yeah. and then we've got the 2013 F-150 Raptor but this is the Shelby version um, also I do apologize I've got the wind um, we've also got the another Tornado Hunters vehicle. Um, this is a bit different compared to this one. This is the newer model. This is the 2017 model, uh, which they've got the roll cage going from the top there to the front bumper. But it's as close as we can get. Um, actually, looks beautiful, beautiful. Uh, one of my favourite cars. And then we've also got the um, this Ford Bronco 19. Uh, 1975, I do apologise, my English is not very well today, <laughs> there, but yes, we've got this bad boy, and we've also got this one in the serve weather unit, uh, Southerner, Southerners, Southerner Storms Chase Team, uh, design on it, so that's that one, we've also got, um, what else is there, haha, <laughs> The GMC Van Der, Van Der um, in the Tornadoes Tours, Extreme Tornadoes Tours uh, van. I do apologise. My English is not very good today. There. <laughs> in, spit it out. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, we've got this bad boy. Um, so, yeah, we've got to test this one out. Um, we've done this one as their tour van as well. As you can see, the way the wind is there. We've got the uh, Weather Channel logo at the back with the... Uh, Bit of a warning sign there as tornadoes. A um, couple logos on the doors there. Plus their logo on the door as well. Um, and then we've also got... Uh, doo -doo -doo. Nope, 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 nope. And we've also got the Nissan Titan, as we just said a minute ago, in the Storm Trackers, um, which is for Weather Channel. Um, uh, design on this bad boy. I did this by hand and it is on the store, so if you're going to check it out, you can do. Uh, but we have got this uh, beautiful, beautiful um, low design on it. As you can tell, it took quite a while. And uh, Leaf Nissan. So we've got a couple of uh, logos on there as well. Uh, and then we've got the final one, which is the Ram Runner, which is in the Storm Cruiser. Um, and theirs is a, uh, the Storm Cruiser vehicle itself, the real version, is a XL version of the Raptor, which is the longer version. Uh, but we did it on this one, and it actually kind of suits it, to be fair, uh, in the Ram Runner. And uh, it kind of looks cool, to be fair. So, first things first, we are going to test out, um, yeah, we're going to test out the, this one that we've got at the moment. Oh, I've got a barn find rumour, so I've got to sort that, find out that later. But we've got a perfect um, course in a second to, to do. A perfect track to test out the handling 
and the off-road and everything on these vehicles. That guy's going up that way. Ah! Completely forgot about him. We've also got sirens to tell everyone that we are a uh, cop vehicle and we've got tornadoes inbound. Um, unfortunately, we don't have tornadoes in this game anyway, so that's good. Ah, we can see Jigsaw over there. He's uh, currently... Uh, I don't know what he's doing at the moment. But we're going to test this bad boy out in the retro muscle. And we've also got to do another one anyway. So, where's the vans? Where are your vans? Where's my van? I need my van. No, I need my van. There it is, van one. There we go. So we've got the van one as well ready to go. Actually, yeah, we'll start the van one off. Uh, we're going to start it off with the GMC. The uh, e Extreme Tornado Tours um, Cruise Van. Oh, Tour Bus, sorry. <laughs> Just, my brain went frazzled then. <laughs> so we're going to test this bad boy out. We've got four-wheel drive in this. Uh, the engine's uh, upgraded to the max. Uh, we've also got four-wheel drive, rally suspension, and off-road tyres. So we should be A-OK. -okay. We're going to jump straight into it. Look at it. It looks awesome. Oh, look at the inside of it. Pretty good. So we'll jump back into third person. Oh, it's a good job I put the uh, off-road suspension on this course. Oh, pretty cool. Oh, a bit argy bargy there. With the uh, Holden's pickup trucks. Don't know who's in the lead. I can't tell. He's too far ahead of me. Yay! Bonk! Someone's going to hit the house. Yeah, they did. So we're going to test these bad boy, or these vehicles, extreme um, terrain, as you can tell. Going through someone's house there, I do apologise. Sorry, my bad. Oh, it's a Subaru. I need to go that way. Ooh, Subaru nearly got hit then. Excuse me, Subaru. Sploosh. Oh, this track is... Oh, we hit the sign there. It's quite bouncy and you can actually test out the suspension and everything. That Subaru is actually quite quick. Uh, Subaru did come out with a uh, pickle truck and there it is. I think that's the BT... The Yard BT or something it's called on the side there as you've just seen. Just briefly. Through the water! And this is actually handling pretty well. Oh, I'm missing that jump. Missing it completely. Whee! There we go. Oh, watch out for the rocks. I have got this vehicle as well on Forza Horizon 4. So we'll do that one later on this week or next week. Do a bit of Forza Horizon 4 and see what vehicles we can do on there. But at the moment, we're going to do a couple more videos on this game. You know, doing the classic, the classic cars that we've got unlocked, um, showing you what barn finds I've found, uh, and uh, doing some cops and robbers. You know, different vehicles, uh, like I did Forza Horizon 2, doing different specials. Obviously, this is the Tornado special or Storm Chasers special edition today, and absolutely annihilate them all. Uh, BMW X5, we've got to stop here. As you can tell, the cars do actually get dirty, so that's another added little feature to the uh, to the game. Thank you very much. Awesome! Almost leveled up again. Ooh, nicely done. So we're going to move on to the next vehicle. Which we'll do with a cop car and then we'll finish it off with the Raptor, um, the Shelby version, so yeah. We'll turn it baby around. 
Ooh. I think I did a pretty good design, a uh, good job on the design front. I did the logo by hand as well, so that was the added one. Um, I added. I know there's a barn fight. Hang on, let me just do this for quickly. Ah, it's not that far. Okay, well, we'll do that later on today. I'll do that in my own time. Find the barn find. I had uh, another... Another jag. <laughs> I've got another jag in the... Uh, in the carriage. Oh, where are you going? Which way are you going, Captain? Jeez, these guys don't know how to drive half the time. Ah, perfect back in there, look. Thank you. And we're going to move on to... Where's the retro muscle? Madu. Is it retro and lose? No, it's retro muscle. Muscle. What am I doing? I need to find it. It's in those. There it is. Uh, yeah, we're just going to do... Hang on. Car theme. Race setting. Ha <laughs> ha. Weather. Heavy rain. Why didn't I not do that? Huh. Uh, morning. Early afternoon. Yeah, we'll do that. And then we'll just jump into it. Oh, right. Okay. Fair enough. <laughs> uh, what? Oh, it's that one. <laughs> My bad. Okay. 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 Right. Then go back into that. Heavy rain. Yes. Okay, 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 guys, we got it, we got it, we covered it, got it, so we're in the police interceptor vehicle, the uh, Ford Victoria Clown, also as a tornado pursuit vehicle, so we've got the lights on top, we've got heavy rain, and we've got the sirens to go with it as well, the, uh, the police siren to go with this vehicle, uh, the actual police um, Tornado Pursuit Vehicle is a Dodge Charger, but unfortunately, um, we don't have lights for that vehicle, and, um, so I had to do it with the Ford Victoria, and it actually suits it, to be fair. We've got heavy rain, we've got off-road suspension, off-road tyres, the, uh, engine is upgraded a little bit as well. So we should be A-OK, -okay. we've got rain as well, if you look in the first person view as you see, nice interior. Uh, <laughs> and we've also got working wipers. Whoa! we got working sirens. Just tell everyone that we have got a tornado inbound, but we haven't at the moment, we've just got storms. Which is perfect weather for for the off-road ones. Uh, 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 bumpity, bumpity, bumpy. Whoa, uh, where are we going? Ah, we've missed it completely. The car went sideways all of a sudden. So we wind it there. Do we have the power? There we go, let go of the power, go back on the power. Because with rear wheel drive, you've got to be really careful on the power. There's Ford Vulcans in the way. Move. Uh. Ow! It's pushing me to go on the outside. Nope, I'm going the inside. Excuse me, got to coming through. Whoa, hello. Actually not doing too bad, we're in 4th uh, position, which is not good. But we are in heavy rain. And as you can tell, the car is definitely handles a lot different compared to in the dry. Oh, my rubber! Yo, which way are you going? Weaving in front of me like that. No, oh, there we go. There's the Buick that just went past. Haha, <laughs> you all slow down. Whoa, okay, maybe you did. That's probably why. What did they eat? Don't eat anything. Uh, 
we'll just carry on. Carry on, carry on, carry on. We're not going to do very well on this race anyway. Ooh, or maybe. Hang on. I tell a lie. They are actually slowing down quite a lot. Oh, we that is second place. Wow, we jumped it back into second. Ooh, come on, Carl, let's do it. That's it, nicely done, nicely. Hey, Ob, where are you coming from? Switch on the inside. Ooh, a bit of a tail slap then. Back end is getting a bit loose. Ah, we just come in third place, that'll do. Third place, we'll take third. That's not bad, top three. Not bad for that terrain and that um, weather either. Sorry, mine went blank again. <laughs> oh yeah, so that was the Victoria Clune Pro Tornado Pursuit Vehicle. Uh, so we're going to move on to the next one. Majestic driving and my magnetic personality have brought in so many new fans that we need to expand the festival again. Really? You don't say? I love that siren. Uh, but yes, we're going to go back to that race. And now to start the other cars. Start off with the Dodge, the Nissan, and then the Ford Raptor. Uh, the orange one, and then the black and orange. In that terrain, it should be a lot more difficult. Oh, a bit of a locking up brakes then. But we're going to go back into here. Who is it? Extreme off road. Is it that one? Yeah. Ah, oh, no, it's not that one. Which one is it? Ah, oh, off road ones. That probably might help. Uh, is it this one? Aha! Yes, it is. So we're going to test these bad boys out. Uh, we're going to start off with the. Uh, like I said, the dodge, and then work our way back. So this video might be a bit longer for you guys, but hopefully you are enjoying it. If you are, please hit that like button, because it has let me know that you are enjoying it. So we are going to start it off with the Dodge Ram, uh, the Storm Cruiser vehicle. Um, so yeah, let's see what this baby can do, shall we? Oh, da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Here we go. Ooh, there's another Dodge Ram there. A Ford, a Nissan. What else is there? Something next to me, but I didn't see it. Damn. Oh, there's a, a Lambo. Yeah, Lamborghini, another Dodge. Uh, and a Raptor. And we've got the Shelby Raptor as well. That's inside of the car, quite nice. Ooh, let's just stick it uh, through the gap. Oh, stormy weather. Glad that I put it in four-wheel drive system. You can put it in rear-wheel drive, but I think the four-wheel drive definitely helps you out a bit. Helps you out that, just that little bit more. Oh, we've broken the windscreen as well. Whoa, what the? It's that way, that way, that way, that way. <laughs> we all went piling in. Everyone hits that house on that corner. Uh, that Ford Raptor is quite good. Wait, bang. Oh, oh, get a bit sideways. Oh, keep in control. Lovely. We had it on two wheels then, apparently. Oh, uh, turn. The stormy weather does not help. Oh, the car does lovely help. Uh, it handles a little bit differently. Compared to Forza Horizon 2 in this uh, wet weather, you actually see the car as you hit the brakes a little bit or you hit it full lock and turn into a corner, it does actually, the car does actually slide that little bit. 
and as you can see, it's sliding quite a lot because obviously it's heavy rain and um, we are off-roading so we had that bit of extra a uh, bit extra slidiness to it, but we have got extra wide tyres on this car. And look at us fly through that water. Uh, uh, uh. Whoa, we're in the air. Land it. There we go. <laughs> Almost didn't land it then. Frog. Whoa, almost lost it then. Bit of a drift in then. Um, but I definitely advise you to, if you do get this uh, vehicle, the Dodge Ram, uh, definitely put it in four wheel drive for off-roading. It definitely helps you out because the front wheels hit the floor and if you have it in rear wheel drive, you're just gonna constantly just spin out. Uh, come on car, you can do it. Yes! Oh, the Ford Raptor wasn't that far behind to be fair. Not bad. Not bad for the, uh, for the Ram. Not bad for the Ram over there. So we're going to move on to the next vehicle. On to the next one! So we're gonna move. Ooh, what we're gonna get? What we're gonna get? Ah, ooh, thirty-five grand. Not bad. Right, let's turn this baby right round. Baby. I like the first person view because you can see the wipers actually working, which is cool. Hey, excuse me, coming through. Hello, there's another Raptor then. Oh, there's the train go past. Did you, Thomas? Why? That's a diesel train actually on this game. Nice, excuse me, coming through. And brake. Oh, a bit of a locking up the front wheels then. So we're going to move on to the next one, which is the Nissan. So we're going to test the Nissan Titan on this one. Blizzard Mountain. Ooh. <sighs> ah. So here we go, we're in this Storm Tracker's vehicle, as you can see there. He's uh, in the way of the, of the logo then. There we go, here we go. Oh, nice in interior. As you can see, nice interior. The outside doesn't look too bad to be fair. Excuse me, Homer. You stop pushing me. Actually, a lot easier to handle compared to the Dodge. She doesn't bounce as much, so I might have to sort the suspension out on the Dodge. Make it a little bit more stiffer. Oh, come on, Nissan. Get past these two Fords. Oh, no, I'm pushing this one out of the way. Come on, Titan. Whoa, hello, Land Rover. No, they all hit the house again. There's the Shelby version. But we're going to finish that on the Shelby. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We're going to use the Shelby one at last, last car. But we've got the Lamborghini in front of us. The off-road version. Um, which is quite different to see a Lamborghini. Lamborghini itself do a off-road vehicle. Um, I'm surprised they didn't put a V12 in it. Like the, uh, you know, the Aventador. Or the uh, Hurricane. It probably has got a V12 in it. You probably can change it to a V12 engine. Um, but I think that would just be too much power on the uh, off-road section. 
I'll keep it a V8. I think this one's a like V8 as well, or a V6. Uh, the Nissan Titan. I need to uh, look at my cars before playing my game. <laughs> and tell you what engine's got on what car. Um, but we're just gonna see. Oh, this car actually handles pretty well. We've got the bump coming up. And there's the bump. Whoa, another bump there. Oh, cranky. Good job we've got the off road tyres and the uh, suspension. Watch out for the rocks here. Is anyone in the rocks actually? Whoa, the Hummer is really bouncing behind us. Go, go, go. Come on, Nissan. It might help if I change gear. Whoa, that Ford Raptor is actually quite quick. We've broken up windscreen again. Come on, baby. Go, 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 go. Nicely done. And past the finish line we go. So, actually quite quick for the, uh, for the Titan there. So we're going to move on to the next vehicle, which would be the Ford Bronco. Uh, the old classic one with the uh, Southern Storm chasing team. And the engine sounds quite nice to be fair in this car. Hello, there's no one this on then. I like the uh, interior in this one. You can see the dials there, look. We have got a supercharger on this instead of a. No, yeah, turbo Turbo? No, supercharger instead of a turbocharger. Um. Let's squeeze through the middle. Thank you. Next, please. Yes, please. And we've got the Bronco. So let's see what this baby can do compared to the um, Raptor. Uh, it's an older model. Kind of reminds me of the um, the shape of it in the old Land Rover. Um, but let's see if it can beat all these big boys up. We've got another Raptor there, so we've got a, quite a few cars, and there is our vehicle. Oh, straight off the line, we are actually quite quicker than them. I think because we're lighter. Excuse me, Homer, could you stop pushing me? There's the interior, quite nice uh, classic interior with the steering wheel. Oh, a bit of a bounce there. Oh, we've got two Land Rovers and a Jeep. Oh no, just a Land Rover and a Jeep. Sorry, my bad. Not just... Hang on, we probably have a second one behind us somewhere. Whee! Oh, land it. Thank you. No, oh, no one's going to hit that. Yeah, someone is going to hit the house. We're going to pass the Jeep there. Can we get past the Land Rover? No, we're just going to squeeze past. A bit of a bounce then with two cars right next to each other. Big, big bounce, but ooh, tail slap. Back end came out then. Ooh, this actually handles pretty well. Not doing too bad. Whoa! Slides up just that little bit, um, but we are a okay. Go, 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 go! Come on, car! Oh, it's a Bronco Ranger. Okay. So it is part of the Ford Ranger um, classes. Straight past that one. 
But we've got that um, bumpy area coming up soon. I might have to go, whoa, what the? Excuse me, let's rewind that a little bit. Oh, he hit the rocks. It might be cheating, but yeah, it'll do. That's why you got rewinds there for a reason. But we are A-OK. -okay. That's better. There's the other Ranger who went past us. Oh, the Land Rover's going fast. Whoa, we're going straight past him. In the air. Almost. Come on, Cal, let's do it. Come on, Ranger. Come on, you Bronco. Nicely done. Whoa. There's the Land Rover and the Jeep just come past us, but we can't, we are quicker in the corners. Oh, we just got that one. The sneak past on the inside. Can we get it? Oh, come on, Cal. Change gear, that might help. I forget what gear I'm in until last second. Boom! Past the finish line. Woo! So that was the Ford Bronco. Have we leveled up? What car? Can we get the E-Type Jack? Can we? Ooh, no, 20 grand. We love that. Thank you. She's a bit bruised and battered, but um, it gives us a, a bit of a repair job when we go on to the next vehicle. the inside of the car, I like the wipers, I think they're cool, they're different compared to normal wipers, they're actually on the top of the car instead of the uh, bottom there at the windscreen, the bottom of the windscreen instead of the top, but obviously this is the older version of the Ranger, didn't realise it said Ranger until I looked at the back of it there, look, and there's the Hummer, oh the Dodge Ram, and the Ford Raptor, <laughs> which we'll be doing in a second. And stop. Yep. Perfect packet. Moving on to the next vehicle, which will be the Ford Raptor 2017 model. Let's see what this baby can do. And then we've got one more vehicle left, and that will be the Shelby version. Uh, also in a Tornado Hunters um, one as well, but we've got the the original, which I think this one, the orange model, the um, this one I've got at the moment is the uh, the older model, one of their ones that they had. Uh, they definitely had an orange one with the writing on the side, and then we had the uh, black on orange. Oh, nice interior! Very, very nice. We've got the spare tyre as well and the bit of a roll cage at the back. A bit of a subframe at the back there to uh, tie everything down. Whoa, hello matey. The Me and the Shelby um, one is uh, battling a bit. But we are not actually not doing too bad to be fair. Whee! Oh, they're all going to hit the house or they? Yeah, one of them did. We almost did as well. We keep an eye on where I'm going. Whee! I landed it. I have got this uh, design on the storefront, so if you want to go and check it out, you can do. If you have got the game. Whoa! Bit of a tail slap. What happened there? Okay, don't go on the inside then. Go, 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 go. Something special about this car, this car does actually have, I'll show you quickly in a second, 10 gears. I don't know why, 
but it has got the uh, Ford, uh, the racing V8 engine in it. I think this one's the 6.2 litre uh, race engine. Oh, we hit the rock. See, that's what I mean. You've got to watch out because this car, on this weather conditions, they do actually slide quite a bit. Hello. Bye. We're going to pass on the outside again. Is he going to do me again? No? Okay, fair enough. Ah, turn. Excuse me. Oh, hello. Having a proper race now. at the top of him! We <laughs> went right on the top of him! Whoa! Bit of a hit there! Ah, that's why I need to... That'll do. Then... Whoa! Bit of a bump again! We almost rolled it! That's why I had to... Oh, we went! Just a little bit! That'll do, that'll do, that'll do! Thank you! We're gonna hit that rock otherwise! Ooh. Well, the only way to hit that rock and spun out. I definitely recommend if you do play this game, put the rewind on because then you can uh, rewind it when you do get it wrong. Oh, the car is getting dirty. Whoa, bit of a tail slide, just that little bit, but I kept it. The other raptor is breathing down my neck. Come on, Tornado Hunter. Let's do it for them. Bang, hit that chair point. Let's go. Open road. Oh, he's just on the inside of me. And we've took it for the win. Whoo, that was close. A bit too close if I would say. But that was that vehicle. 2017 model. Wow. I'm at level 60. Let's continue to the next vehicle in line. Oh, that 2017 model is quite good actually to be fair. And it, it actually suits the uh, design that I put on it, as you can see. Very high um, gear ratios. I think I needed a bit, um, a bit more speed. Actually, no, I'll keep it as it is because I like it. There's another Raptor. Oh, there's an orange one as well. <laughs> what a coincidence that is, eh? I think they've uh, downloaded my design. If they have, then uh, bonus. There's another sign over there. I need to go and get that afterwards. And we're going to use the last one, but not least, the 2013 F-150 SVT Raptor Shelby Edition. Um, I think the Shelby one in this is a lot more different compared to um, other vehicles. Uh, I think Shelby did actually build this, them. I'm not too sure actually, I don't know why it says Shelby. I think Shelby is the one who joined uh, Ford to build a... Uh, Raptor version. I think this is one of the one of their cars, and I think it's got a Shelby engine in it instead of the uh, the Raptor. I think it's got the uh, Shelby engine. Because if you remember way way back in the Forza Horizon 2, I did put a Shelby uh, GT500 engine in the um, this vehicle. Actually, I think it is. Uh, I think it's the, this M1 or the uh, younger model, which is the 2015 or 14 model. I did put a Shelby engine in it, so I think because the uh, Shelby joined up with them, and they thought, you know what, that sounds like a good idea, and they uh, came out with this car. And uh, the interior is quite nice. I'm battling another Shelby in a second. Whoa! What the? Oh, he kind of nudged me. I think I'm glued to his side there. Look. Let him go ahead. There we go. He's going to crash into that. 
building anyway. Whee! Thanks, Homer. You left us. You left us with a uh, an opening. There, we're just gonna follow you for a second. Whoa! Okay, moving up. Hello, Land Rover. Thanks for that Porsche. The Dodge Rams just went past us. Go, 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 go! Through the water. Like piece of cake. Whoa, we just hit it. I, I think this is one of my favourite vehicles on this game. Um, well, it is my favourite vehicle on this game, actually, to be fair. I quite like the design. Um, I downloaded this. Well, I think I. Yeah, I downloaded this one. And. Uh, Whoever made this design for this vehicle, absolutely brilliant, but you can't see it at the moment because it's absolutely filthy at the moment. Whee! Through the water. You see the light bars on the top and the spare wheel. You've still got space to put your luggage and equipment in the back there, as you can see. Whoop. Drop it down again, that helps. Whee! Oh, and it. Ooh, watch out for that rock. I wonder how many people actually hit that rock every time. So I definitely recommend to get this car. You do get the game. It's one of the best games actually. Uh, this and Forza Horizon 4 is one of my favourite games now. Um, I do like the Forza Horizon range. Uh, Forza 1 and 2. I quite enjoy them as well. I enjoyed the second one a lot more than the first one to be fair. Um, but yeah, we did uh, definitely do tornado ones on there as well, so they're up on the channel. And past the finish line we go. Ah, the defender, then the Hummer came th uh, third. Not bad. Yeah, she's a bit damaged. <laughs> Whoops, <laughs> we did bang around a bit. We did get a bit of damage on that one. Hey, level 16! Nice! The Dodge Challenger SRT Hellcat. Can we win it? Oh no, we're going to get 5 grand. I will take that. It would be beneficial if we did win the uh, car, but you can't win it every time. So we're going to finish it off and we're going to park it up at the fuel station as we started off with the, uh, this video. Because we need to go and get fuel after that race. Probably this car anyway. I think I've done all the vehicles, did I? Yeah, I definitely did. And there's the carriage. Ah, lovely jubbly. So we park a uh, right about hang on, a bit more, bit more. There we go. And then we'll just do it in drone mode for get a nice screenshot for you guys. And uh, yeah, we'll leave that video here and settle. Hide. So yes, yeah, so if you did like this video, hit that like button and let me know in the comment section below which one was your favourite storm chasing vehicle. Um, but yeah. That was it. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the notification bell when I upload videos. But from me, Team Smudge Racing Gaming, I'll catch you guys in the next video. And don't forget to have a smashing day. Bye.